Well, the good news at this point is we do know that nobody was injured in the fire, but I'll, I'm standing in front of the building. I'll step out of the way so you can get a look. This is the uh, sanctuary building from the P uh, Ch Pulaski Church of God, and uh, clearly this morning it is a total loss. Fire crews have left the scene this morning, but we still don't have an answer as to what could have caused this fire. We've learned this church has been in the community for around 100 years, and some people attending the church have been doing so for up to 50 years. Speaking with the fire marshal, Todd Garwood, we've learned part of the difficulty in finding out what caused this fire has to do with the way the building collapsed. The roof is now on the floor, so in order to know what was under there and what may have happened, either from below or even above, we have to start removing this, the roof, and then we have to remove what's under the roof and just work our way all the way down to the floor, and you have to do that by layers, and if you don't do it by layers, you're going to miss something. Well, at this point, Garwood says they don't have any evidence yet to uh, suggest that this fire was set intentionally. Now, the pastor and several members of the congregation are here with us this morning, and we're going to be speaking to them shortly, and we'll bring you all the latest details coming up tonight on WSLS 10 starting at 5 o'clock. In Pulaski, Rob Manch, WSLS 10.